Western Spain Television, as it is. Series of reforms in governance embarked upon by Governor Atimola Teleke for almost two years are targeted at creating a strong base for economic viability of Oshun State through sustained turnaround of its agricultural sector. Significantly, government is focused on relieving the past glory of agrarian revolution, which the Oshun Division of the defunct Western Region was noted for. Getting the state on its feet again after 12 years of neglect of the agricultural sector has led to massive investment in mechanized farming, rural road infrastructure and provision of impetus for cooperative farmers. All this are occupying the front burners of policies, projects and projections aimed at making a sure state not only a food basket, but a state with a gross domestic product tied to development of all units of agriculture. The Ministry of Agriculture and Food Security has been repositioned to fulfill this task. How is the journey so far? Episode 9 of Living Spring Update will today outline the turnaround effort of the Adelic administration at making us show self-sufficient and secured in food and cash crops production as veritable vehicles of economic growth and development. My name is Tomilola Daniel. Governor Demola Deleke's economic policy framework is aimed at making Oshun State a driver for inclusive mass-oriented development of human and natural resources within our domain. But he has left no one guessing on what this economic policy framework is. The governor is set to open the vast opportunities of an agrarian state where the living standards of the people can be enhanced and huge revenues are obtained by government to execute projects for self-sufficiency in food production. The state government's industrial development and infrastructural turnaround policy comes with heavy financial outlay, which the governor is convinced can be serviced by a comprehensive revamping of his agricultural sector. This is the pivot of the state government's agro-industrial transition program. Governor Deleke has publicly declared his administration's preparedness to kick off activities in the agricultural sector, using the parameters already set by his administration for that purpose. The governor has been very busy conferring with stakeholders in agriculture and the results are encouraging. He believes that the rural urban development projects in various stages of construction in the state will encourage investors in the agribusiness who were either to driven back by the previous administration's uncaring attitude towards exploring the natural and human resources of the state in agriculture. No farmer, no farmer, at the inception of this administration, for administration, we crafted our policy, objective, and also fashion and agenda towards the realization which was tied the five point agenda. In less than two years of our administration, we have effectively touched every aspect of the five point action plan we set out to achieve at the inception. Today, Today, we are distributing 6,000 head by side, 80,000 
cashew seedlings, 8,000 cassava cuttings, 8,000 various vegetable seeds, and 500 bags of lime to our farmers today. Oshun State is blessed with rich arable land that has placed her among Nigeria's Green Belt Zone. As a division in the Old Western region, it attracted the establishment of farm settlements at various parts of the division, which added significantly to the state as an economic stronghold and commercial hub for the Western region. Years of neglect and shifting attention have had negative effect on the status of this farm settlement and their capacity to turn around the agricultural sector. Ocean State Government will not allow this to continue. Information available to Living Spring Update points to a renewed vigor by the Ministry of Agriculture and Food Security to reactivate these farm settlements in a gradual process of redesigning, resource mobilization and deployment. The Special Advisor to the Governor on Agriculture and Food Security, Honorable Olaniron Akonfe Atidade, disclosed that the state government is determined to deliver on its five-point agenda, particularly as it relates to empowering the farm communities to respond to the threat posed by inadequate food supply nationwide. He emphasized the urgent need to get farmers back to their farms for cultivation, harvesting and processing of agricultural production on a massive scale. The Ministry has been trying all our best through the help of the state government, His Excellency Ashwaju and Jackson Demola Deleke, being part of his five-point agenda when he was doing his political campaign and when he resumed the office, he has been doing very wonderfully well among the farmers in the state. Uh, since the assumption of the office, the governor has put in place a lot of empowerment by giving out inputs and uh, giving out input and also an uh, aspect of giving out belts for poultry farmers and all. Uh, the government is working tirelessly on how to protect the farmers uh, about their crops, their input, their produce. That is the reason why the government is empowering the agro rangers and also the Amotekuns under the leadership of, uh, uh, I don't know the rank, Mr. Omoyele, which is the boss of the Amotekun and also working in hand with the agro rangers to make sure the farmers and the Fulani are on the same page, which they will not use their animal to affect the crops which the farmers are planting and the farmers also will not be fighting Fulani about their own cows also. Their business must not affect each other's business. So the government is working about security on the farms and how the Fulani X-Men will know how to give their cows and animals boundary so they will not be able to eat the, the crops which farmers plant on their farm. Oshu state government recently took delivery of 31 newly assembled tractors in the first phase of its agri transition program that is expected to kickstart its agri revolution policy. The tractors had provoked uh, controversies from the opposition on the number and identity of its purchases. The state government has, however, left no one in doubt on the purchase of the tractors. The special advisor to the governor on agriculture and food security response to this controversy provided clear answers to the inquiries, adding that the agricultural transition program is being carried out in compliance with due process. Uh, so, Katakata ti ti aku wale olola julo walora ashiwa ju duro dim Jackson demo la deleke a olora Katakata i Katakata ndera is one round thing. Tora, but I want to ti assemble. Kuma de kebi ya uduma lomo alowo. Ma jenge kwa kwa I want to ti assemble yen. To kumonja de fun usage a wagbe. So, eto fun a wagbe ni ndi weta i oje onko thirty one jade no. Or not a flag of it. We since they pay at him bossy as you could hear you, Lord, dear. Come away, we are going to rack at a catai. I come back, I come, I come see 
inu le a fe ko ri bi ti oga wa ti ra tetele to e pe won mismanage e to le ba de oke ogun nisin on la on kata kata ipinle osun kan si wa loke ogun disin to ko o e se ji si lara so ogun ati manage e ni olola julo wa o se ni pe ka ko gbe jade ni yanya ka ko ko awon ko jade na ka obi won se lo si ibu awon to ko jade nsin bayi ati ipin jade tori on pe kini kan ni tracker on se awon tracker en lowo si ara re to e pe ko si en tun o gbe si akata re ti o le paro tori a mo wo lori computer wa iye hector city katakata en se ibi ti katakata na wa iye epo ton ra si a mo wo lori computer wa so no fa ti won ti se gbe jade kan pin si oni jojo lasiko yi en federal government ora katakata fashion ademola deleke lo fi wo na oni ora katakata Oshun State Government's Agricultural Revolution Initiative is value addition with agro processing as a focus. The Adelike administration is inclined to an export-oriented agricultural economy and is making progress on a program of action on agropreneurs that will employ the expertise of farmers across the local government areas of the state. The Ministry of Agriculture and Food Security has been geared to give effect to this policy. The ministry is currently reviewing expert proposals for the establishment of mechanized tractorization assembly plants which will optimally move the agricultural sector in the state to the next level. Olola julo wa nju oseleku loko kan ni. Proposal so proposal to jobe o wa ni waju won. Sugbon a gboro ko irin to po si na ko le ni tumo. Ko mo di ke bi a eyan kan un sese abo 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 abo. Olora julo wa nse kan lase yo ri ko to bo si ori mi iru nsin bayi ohun ti ohun leyin ti ati ra katakata nisin ohun pe kini kan ni agro processing zone ohun lo julo ni olora julo wa tun nawo si lati se nisin pe ogbo ere oko awa ni sentoria district mere eta to wa ni pele osun in teyin ba te ba ere oko yin ni bi e ku lo si bi ere oko yin ni sentoria bi e ku lo si bi ibe ni awon to wa fe ra ni olopo to wa fe ra ni eleyo to ni ke bi a ehun ti ohun ta ti egbe lori oko nbi ibo lati eta si tori iro ndu mamba wa gbenu ati da koko ni wa lasu gbe ibo lati ire oko wa si so ohun ti olola julo wa mu oju to lowo ile ile yin tan ti jeju oro ni katakata tan Honorable Commissioner for Agriculture and Food Security, Otumba Tola Fashero, reeled out the vision and the revamping of the hitherto redundant ministry in line with the agenda of Governor Demola Adeleke. The ministry is about um, ensuring food sufficiency for the people of Oshun State, ensuring that food is affordable, uh, and then that through agriculture we can uh provide jobs for our teaming population and then we're able to apart from the consumption we're able to um make available um uh, food inputs uh or what i call raw materials for agro industries basically we uh i work stretches to every part of the state all the tiny one local government of the state and as you are aware we also have nine farm settlements uh, spread across the state and basically that's that's the job the job is to ensure that the impact of our ministry is felt in every nook and cranny of of our state not only that that we have not only that we have food su sufficient for all in the state but we're able to have enough that can flow to other states so that at the end of the day we want to become the food basket of the nation and of course again being able to have some of our surplus exported out to other countries here the mope lara kini ogawa eh gomina wa eh ojo gbon eh achiwaju senator nuruje 
Jackson and Demola, and the key. Lara won't come out, you won't be silly, but you won't be a job by a share of me. At the latterly fee, she and Cotoma call you fee, share of me, coffee die, share, be the pinna, silly. Uwana na kuti uje pataki nino untemaru ti gumi na watu mo filole imbati wondi ichenye vision mo mandate ye la wa mtele unde lolo unde unongo lolo lati le ma towa sano lati le pe leni pele osho wa ubeni. I've been in Nuka Ogbe. Taba Bubbepo, see Tabawa Pile, you could. Pinel Shedada. I've been in Rara. London or Waro, the bootleg Jeppe, one ground young panel pay, shell among the Lilo, see Okun to the Bubbawa, while I want down the right to convey. Boni or so, I don't know what I want to get a lafia or job. I want a bear one or less only lost your co. Line if you bear, line if bear, I want Jenny Bay, I'll be on the road. I do pay a fiasco, you do pay a little gum now. Full share to one ship, Nepa, Uba. All the security apparatus, which you manage, well, actually, I'm a soldier, I'm a police, I'm a motor, I'm a civil defense. So you get people born to share. You force to walk up. So they get people that born long. Abu, Atiyalafia, Owa Fawa, Bewa. Ni pele osho. Ni ba ti yade. Nko ta ban le obrujai. Lobo a wan tu wan ni joba. Ti wan joba tele. Nko ta de rin pe a wan joba midej. Kon ba luri a li fa kawa tu di pe. Wan fi yon on peut tout le chien et là là. So, il va te dire qu'il y a moins de bon ministre là-bas, moins de bon secteur là-bas. Aussi, les machines, quand on fait tant que les autres, on fait clair à l'air, on fait clair à l'air. Aussi, quand tu veux t'arriver, elle est aussi par où chez nous, mais où chez nous, elle est ni un soyeur. So il y a un fait faire que les gens se sentent à tout le monde. Il y a un peu de temps. 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 So one day, my share of my luck on Dudu, on the repay of good support here. Two more time when you are two more intelligent, as you do Majila, T. Joba PDP, twenty feet of Basile, two more relative by a great name, Gumnova, the one Bishi, a lot to leave. Ati di pe wanri nko tu yu Bo bo yon lo wato ma anfe La to ri bo bo Input a jile Seedlings Kondo ma anbe Kemika bo bo a wong kobe yon Le ngo mina wa Fitem o lono Titi de a wong mi to wong ron lo wo La fo wong ni masin La to fi si shek Ebra, on tourne chez pour, on fait un machine, on fait une loi, 
que nem que nem é poia tu não tu não deu para um brinco até o tu não chegou a tu não chegou já o bom que tu não fez prisão já fiz a tu não fez prisão tu lhe marcou a gente assim tu lá te repre o o keep o bom cabelo nem gominou a mo pisi fua mo yawa wande ripe amu bini kafu ni special attention amu bina tamu doa pole ripe atimbe policy consilensi policy tani tele bitu tana na seven ni swa ti change gumi no alu kawu kawu viwe wande tinche tipe de last stage policy yekele Ari pe bigo mna wachi sopo, amu robini kujua ni nu policy, ata amu akonda, so uboya no, ukudi ya bigo mna ama baba lunchi, but ati bresi bibu banki ni ati nlo, ni nu bache shetu, mbwe ni ni peleosho, so ndi ari pe bibu tu tanchi. A foro bem se a moro bem o chefe está aqui a chamar a conta a de que o bem se o bem está bem empower o bem ele vai ter que empower family ni é bem a vai ter que empower family a de empower o luni a de empower o luni empower state a de empower state a de empower Uli le dini tu ya wajawa, mo la kikonju, mo de mo de mo budi tu ebi, tu tiaba romano, tiaba tiro romano, ba chini, uben un 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 demu dia dia si fa mnyawa ni, adupe lo wanti alon fisho luriwa ni pile. Ni pili yako, asikuwa tuni, asikuwa fua mwa bwa, fua mwa bwa, onchori ni eli bogo, bogo inua mwa bwa, madem chadwa, fum kuminoa. The Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Agri and Food Security, Mr. Maruf Agbolao Lawale, stated that the Ministry have started the distribution of farm impute to farmers free of charge in a bid to achieve sustainable food security in Ocean State. Currently, we are sharing fertilizers free of charge to everybody. It just come to the ministry. We are going to give you giving. Fertilizer. And apart from this, the ministry is currently distributing cassava uh, sticks to our farmers. We are giving them free of charge. And apart from this, we are also distributing uh, farm input like tomato, vegetables, and uh, pepper to everybody in the state, regardless of party affiliation, just come to the ministry, you get it free of charge. On the Moribund Farm Settlement, Mr. Lawale stated that the ministry led by the commissioner has paid a working visit to six out of the farm settlement in line with his vision to resuscitate them. We have uh, visited some uh, farm settlement is it? We have about farm. We have about ten farm uh, farm settlement in the state. We have visited about six, and uh, the challenges of this uh, farm settlement have been identified. So we are currently working seriously on how to address these challenges. Uh, recently, we have been working with uh, local government areas in the state on how to get more land to be used for our youth in the area of farm activities. Some of these uh, local government areas have promised us to give 1,000 hectares of land. 
and they were working on it. We have had meetings with our royal fathers, and they, they have uh, given us their words to support us in the area of uh, land uh, for us. And uh, let me tell you this. Before now, we had uh, farms in our schools. For, for long, this has gone more bond. But recently, we had meetings at our schools. And uh, when they are resuming now, they are resuming to start farm in schools. We have promised them to give them farm input. And uh, they have uh, come to us. We have agreed on it. And uh, recently, too, we introduced a method of farming tagged Okwetile, where everybody said we have a small farm in his backyard. So that at the end of the day, they have something to get from their farmyard. Uh, but some of our people are complaining about uh, animals roaming uh, the street. I'm happy to tell you that some of our royal fathers have discussed the issue with their subjects, and their, so their, their subjects have complied. If you go to Eshokina, if you go to Jebujesha, if you go to uh, uh, Iloko, you cannot see any domestic animal from the street again. I've had a series of meetings with uh, farmers, and uh, we have had a series of meetings meeting with our cat dealers and our Fulani people. We have been holding meetings and they have been promised us that uh, very soon they will work on how they are going to keep their cattle within a particular, a particular vicinity so that cow roaming the street, disturb, disturb the farm of uh, people, we become a thing of past. And uh, we have uh, rangers too. These rangers are our security people who are working on our farms to guard against the cow disturbing the farmers in the farm. The permanent secretary also stated the efforts of the ministry in ensuring that the old tractors that were initially in dilapidating state are brought back to life. Those ones that were grant, that were in the state of disappear, Mr. Governor has a approved fund for us to repair the old ones and very soon about eight of, eight of them will be repaired. We are currently working on them. Osho State projected investment in the agri sector are obviously massive. The government has budgeted over 10 billion naira to boost food and cash crop production in the state. Besides the newly acquired tractors, cashew, cassava and vegetable farmers have been mobilized in their hundreds with episodes and seedlings while the farms are being cleared for cultivation via Moteco Core been reprogrammed to operate effectively than previously. Security has been guaranteed and the farms will come to life again. And that's it on today's 11th Spring Update, Episode 9. We promise another session with you next week. I am Tomi Lola Daniel. Bye for now. Spring Update is a production of the Office of the Spokesperson to the Governor, Governor's Office, Ushubu.